Welcome to the show, the defending UAAP Women's Volleyball Champion, the USD Spiking Tigresses. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Uh, coach, uh, first of all, um, how hard is it to maintain the standard of the team that defending champion na every year there are mga players that are graduate? How hard is it to recruit in volleyball? We had a problem. We won the title 10 years before we won the, the championship last year. Mm -hmm. So, talagang naubusan kami ng player. So, I recruited them. Ito, ito yung main core ng team na nirecruit ko. And uh, first year namin, we end up fourth place. Okay. And then, yung so, second, nine-up na. Nine-up champion na kami. And then, hopefully, to win the championship again this year. What's a, ano bang pinakamalaking problema, coach, pag kumukuha kayo ng players? from the provinces. Yung bang hindi pinapayagan ng magulang na pumunta ng Maynila o nahihirapan sa pag-aaraw? No, that's one. Um, pangalawa yung one, yung standard ng education sa mm -hmm. province. Most uh, special yung galing sa uh, public school. Mm -hmm. Nagkakaroon ng culture shock minsan sa, <laughs> sa, sa standard ng di ba, sa university oh. dito sa Manila. Sa so, player naman, uh, I think pinakamahirap na hanapin sa amin dito si Denise, yung center. Uh, uh, wala kami makuha ang center na malaki. Okay. Siya lang yung naging center namin talaga na matangkad, na pwede sa national team. Medyo matangkad nga sila ang dalawa eh. Okay, hindi mo kang tayo itong dalawa kasama. Yeah, sit down. Sit down. Let's talk about the two players, Denise Smith. Sabi nga ni Coach, it took a couple of years bago kayo nakaakit sa championship. Ano yung pinakamahirap na part? Um, I think yung adjustment na ginawa namin kasi nung first year na parang we were all rookies. Okay. And then, you know, um, out of 14, parang yun nga, nine kami rookies. So, wow. Diba? It's hard, you know. Yeah. Tapos, parang we had to step up talaga. Yeah. Even. Yeah. But with, with nine rookies, you guys sort of grow up together. Diba? I mean, yeah. parang you, you know each other's movements already. The familiarity gets to be um, developed. Yeah, you, you get to know, back. parang you're, you're, you're growing up together. Mm -hmm. So parang that familiarity helped out for the championship, right? Yeah, it did. And um, there in some ways then, um, it's really hard kasi parang lahat kayo magkakabatch. Yeah. So walang parang Wala junior, leader mga ganun. Yeah, and parang no one really steps up talagang. Parang, but who eventually took on the leader's role as far as your team was concerned? Well, I don't mean, you know, I don't want to brag. Ah! 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 Then, parang ang hirap nila ang hulugan ng bola, parang kahit saan nakukuha nila. Really? <laughs> yeah. Is it, is it more a question, is today's game, you've, you've been with the team for quite a while, uh, has, has, has the game evolved to it just being power-oriented, to being speed-oriented, for to it being strategy-oriented? How has the game evolved for you now? Mm, for me, ano, when I was in high school, talaga, parang I viewed volleyball as a power sport. Mm -hmm. Like, if you spike hard, you're good. Yeah. But it's not like that anymore. Yeah. Um, parang when I went to USD, I found out na defense. mental sport siya. I mean, you could score with like just, you know, tipping the ball. Okay. Yeah, you know. You don't have to exert that much effort. Yeah. So, but you don't, you don't need a dunk. You can just make a layup. It's yeah. worth two points, mm -hmm. no matter what. <laughs> Because you don't use your feet, that's okay. Let's ask Anjali, the emergence of a commercial league for women's volleyball, how much is it? Exposure, parang confidence. It's like a lot of confidence that you're known as a person. So you're going to be able to get an autograph? Actually, yes. 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 Pag-feature ng kuna. Pag-feature ng kuna. Pag-feature ng kuna. Pag-feature ng kuna. Pag-feature ng kuna.
<laughs> no, but we, what is what is it like? Because uh, you know, you get you get to play on television, which yeah. is, you know, the past years. Hindi naman nakikita yung mga players ng volleyball sa TV. What is that? How does it feel? Well, it feels good. Um, it feels good. Uh, 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 Walang pressure. Wala. Yeah. You, you I mean, already just, zone it out. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, you just have to focus and like, you take it positively na parang, oh, there's so much fans and like, you know, just like, I have to play really good, you yeah. know, not like, like, I can make a mistake and like that. Yeah. So you can't be afraid of it. You yeah. really can't be afraid. Yeah. You just have to play, enjoy, and enjoy the crowd. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Coach, sa inyo, sa panig naman ng pagko-coach ngayon, Nakikita na kayo sa TV, pag, you know, pag nahihirapan kayong, halimbawa, magbigay ng instructions sa mga players, anong effect naman sa inyo bilang coach? Kasi sa amin, uh, wala masyado, uh, I mean, just say, this is international. <coughs> Ang problema lang doon yung, like, yung management, uh, simply to manalo. And uh, we can have win all the games. Uh -huh. so, but uh, I think yung pinakamagandang ginawa ng team ko, um, they just don't win the games. Mm -hmm. They won the heart of the crowd. Uh, and the, the school was very proud uh, sa ginawa nila. Okay. Kasi sa ngayon, sabi nga nyo, kung hindi pa sila ninenervyos sa game, mm -hmm. Actually, paano ni nervous yun sila? Alam nila, 80% nung nanonood kanila. Parang tayo lumalakas ang nanonood kanila. Hindi ko tinis guys. Home court o kahit saan. May barangay na nga tawag sa kanila. Barangay UST. Good luck with the ongoing tournament. At sana kung patuloy ang tagumpay ninyo. We'd like to thank once again the UST Spiking Tigresses for gracing hardball for the first time. Still ahead, Piston Celtics 2 at down the wire. Okay, Tigresses are coming. Let's just remind everybody out there that any time a team guests on the hardball, what happens? They win! They become champions. They become, they become champions. champions. Wow. Yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Gina Rapino. And I'm Bill Velasco. Join us again tomorrow when we hit hard and hit strong. When we play hardball! Oh, I look in in this jacket.